All right, you guys, here's the beauty about burgers. Let your imagination be your guide. Salami, pastrami, cilantro, pickles. You can make everybody happy with a simple burger. Okay, I ground my sirloin, my brisket, and my short rib in my Live to Cook grinder. Now it's time to make the patties. We ground all our fresh meat, sirloin, brisket, uh, and a little bit of short rib in there. Now we're gonna press them in the burgers. This is so easy and it's so delicious. Bad burgers are frozen, overpacked. Here with the Live to Cook Burger Press, watch this. We take about six ounces of meat, we put it in there, you can adjust the size right on top. Goes in the press, the press is non-stick, so it's super quick. Down we go, wipe off the excess, burger done. And this is great, you kind of get everybody involved at home, kids, family, everybody pressing out burgers so you can bust out the party quick, and they're consistent, burger to burger which is important. When you're on the grill, you don't want an eight ounce burger and a six ounce burger next to each other. One's gonna be well, one's gonna be rare. Now look, sliders are the rage. Kids love them, adults love them for little parties. You do the same thing with sliders. Just look, it's about an ounce or so of meat, right in the press. Same thing, it is non-stick. My nephews love these things. I give them the meat, I give them the press, they have at it. 20 sliders later, I'm ready to party. Look at this, right in. Give it the press, wipe off that excess, and then we can just flip it on our plate, and we are ready to grill. Beautiful. It's grill time.